de los Higgins iba a ser tanto. It's a little bit. Can you hear me, guys? Yeah? Yes. 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 Excellent. Yes. Thank you, thank you, thank you very much for waiting. Uh, it, it was a problem with my computer, so I was, I was not charging my computer, but I had it on because I always have my computer on for the, before the class, right? Just to, to get everything ready. But when I connected my computer, I plug, it's not connected. When I plug my computer to the power, eh, it was like, it was not loading. Y decía batería baja. And it was not loading. And I was like, what? No me digan que se me arruinó la batería o el cable. And I was like, what, what? And I'm sweating, you guys, I'm sweating. <laughs> and then I just turned the computer off. And then I turn it on because la luz, esta luz que da aquí de cuando uno le conecta el cable, da una luz, ¿no? Entonces esa luz me decía que sí estaba like on, pero la compu me decía que no estaba cargando. No me parecía el de, de like, entonces I was like, what's happening? But now, yes, solo la apagué, la volví a encender y apareció, era como que, como cuando al carro se le arruina la luz, el, el que avisa. Yeah, something like that. But thank you, thank you, thank you very much. Thank you for waiting, you guys. Thank you so much, okay? So, teacher, ya no nos cuente, ¿verdad? Este, pase lista, a lo que vino. Oh, my God. Teacher, I, I have some video from the, have... from the, my company. Videos about? About the, how to make a newspaper. Uh-huh. Yeah, yesterday I can stay in the class because I have some trouble in my in my job, mm -hmm. and I can take a, a video about the problem. I, and I would like to show you. Oh, you would like to play the video? Yeah. In the class? It, it is possible. Tiene derecho de autor. Sí, el mío. Ah, usted lo hizo. Sí. ¿Cuánto dura? Lo que usted quiera, puede durar un minuto, dos minutos, tres minutos, lo que me deje mostrarlo. Ah, ok, sí, claro. Solo déjeme al final de la clase si podríamos verlo, Rolando. Uh -huh, sí. Ok, ok, Para no, ya. Yeah, tengan, tengan una idea de cómo se hace un periódico. Wow, that, that's interesting, ok. Yeah, that's interesting. Gracias. Thank you for sharing. Ok. Ok, vamos a ver aquí. Solo voy a ir con la asistencia, you guys. Y lo dejo de último, right, because with the time, right. And si me van a disculpar porque la clase va a ir terminando como a las 15, ok, or around that, ish, ish, porque siempre termina la like, guía, yeah. ish. So, uh, let's go with the attendance para que no nos tardemos más. Uh, Ana Beatriz. I'm here. Valencia Ruiz. <ríe> ok. Then Ana Elizabeth Berrios de Sandoval. I'm here. Brenda Erlinda Sáenz Villatoro. I'm here. Claudia Lorena Carca Morgueta. Diana Yesenia Reyes Salas. Estefanía Alexandra Aguilar Céspedes. Florida Alma Ramírez Calderón. I'm here. Harvey Isaac Guevara Miranda. Jennifer Gisela López Sánchez. I'm here, teacher. Juan José Avalos Campos. I'm here. Um, Katia Margarita Herrero Pérez. I'm here. Kerry Tiffany Rosales Figueroa. Merlin Lisbeth Ventura Cruz. Yo vi a Merlin un ratito, but then I don't. Miguel Ángel Centeno González. I'm here. Rolando Antonio Quintanilla en Ciudad Real. I'm here. Ruth Saraí Medrano Aguilar. I'm here. Ruth Noemí Sánchez Pérez. Suleima Lisset Méndez Romero. William Antonio Morales Mancía. En Jessica Yanari Cortés Díaz. I'm here. José Efraín Cáceres Escalante. En Silvia María Rivera Rivas. Okay, guys, so before we start with the class, teacher, give me 15 minutes of finishing. Okay, thank you for letting me know. Okay, before we start with the class, I have something to tell you. 
um, I had a meeting today <clears throat> at 7 p.m. So I was just in a meeting. So estaba en una reunión hace poquito. And nos hicieron saber que ustedes ya van a tener los correos con el, la encuesta de satisfacción, que es una de las últimas cosas que se hace. Ok, so nos dijeron. Por favor, y se lo voy a decir en español porque quiero que quede claro, que por favor esa encuesta de satisfacción se hace aquí en la clase. ¿Ok? Les va a llegar el correo antes, probablemente mañana, no, jueves, viernes, entre jueves y viernes les llega ese correo. So, el que llegue ese correo no significa que usted ya tiene que... Perdón, me estoy acomodando. Que usted ya tiene que uh, llenar esa encuesta de satisfacción. Ahí hay un link. Ustedes es primera vez que están en estos cursos. Yo sé que alguna gente es primera vez, ¿verdad? Bueno, al final, bueno, ya les pasaron una encuesta que es sobre mi evaluación docente, ¿verdad? Eso yo creo que ya lo hicieron. ¿Sí? No. No. Es... Pero no, sí les tuvo que llegar un no. correo. Yo lo recibí por correo y por WhatsApp. Uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh, uh -huh. Yo también. Rolando, ¿y en qué, cómo, uh, cuándo les mandaron ese WhatsApp? Porque yo sé que se los mandaron a todos. Uh, let me check. I don't remember. The date. Um, So, revisen ahí los, los WhatsApps que les han llegado de, de inglés corporativo, porque tiene que haber uno que es sobre evaluación docente. Hay un link, si no me equivoco, hay un link para una encuesta. So, denme una reacción las personas que sí ya hicieron esta evaluación docente. Yo ya lo hice el 25 de mayo, lo recibí. 25 de mayo, sí, es que yo sé que fue ya hace el ratito. Yeah. Uh -huh. Yes. ¿Sí? Entonces, revisen si está ahí y si no está de ninguna manera, entonces me lo dejan saber para yo comunicar, porque ustedes tienen que hacer esa evaluación sobre mí. ¿Ok? Esa es interna para inglés corporativo. ¿Ok? Esa no tiene nada que ver con Insaforp, sino para que usted diga si está satisfecha, con el ser, satisfecha o satisfecho con el servicio que yo les he brindado. Una. Pero está la otra que es como crucialmente importante. Esta encuesta es la de Insaforp, ¿ok? Esta encuesta les va a llegar mañana o el viernes les llega ese correo. Hay un link para hacer una evaluación, pero lo voy a repetir de aquí hasta el fin de las clases. No, <ríe> no hagan esa encuesta por su cuenta. Esa encuesta se va a llenar aquí en la clase. Juntos y juntas vamos a llenar esa encuesta con los datos que ahí le van a mandar. Le van a enviar un correo donde están todos los datos que se tienen que escribir en esa encuesta, pero es muy crucial que no la haga antes porque la vamos a hacer todos juntos y juntas porque si me hacen un error pequeño por pequeño que sea, ya se la invalida Insaforp, ¿ok? Entonces, yo se los digo porque sé que para muchos es primer módulo que estamos acá. Para otras personas que ya lo saben, ya saben que esta encuesta se realiza al final y que hay que poner unos datos que nos envían al correo o al WhatsApp. Mi sugerencia, esta encuesta nosotros la vamos a hacer, vean ahí el calendario, las vamos a estar llevando a cabo el 8 de junio, o sea, el martes que viene. 8 de junio vamos a hacer esa encuesta. Este correo o WhatsApp le va a llegar antes a ustedes, pero ese día en clases, todos juntos vamos a realizarla, ¿ok? okay. ¿Por qué? Porque siempre hay preguntas, siempre hay errorcitos, siempre hay esto, lo otro, entonces es mejor hacer esa encuesta juntos porque ya no se puede volver a repetir. Ok, usted ya lo que manda ya queda así en Insaforp. Denme un segundo, guys. I'm sorry, my allergies. Ok, so, no podemos volver a repetir esa información ni se puede volver a enviar la encuesta. Si usted ya la envió así, con los datos que hizo y tuvo un error ahí, ya se quedó así. 
Entonces, vamos a hacer esa encuesta juntos en la clase. ¿Queda claro ese punto? ¿Sí? Sí. Yes. Ok. Thank you, sí, thank you yes. very much. I appreciate it. Ya sí, encontré, diga, dígame, Ana. Las dos encuestas las vamos a hacer juntos. No. La encuesta que es evaluación docente, esa la hace usted aparte. Mi nombre es Diana Rodríguez o Diana Rodríguez Ayas. Para, porque yo sé que Rolando me estuvo preguntando, ¿qué, qué, ¿qué está pasando? I didn't know what was happening. But yeah, es Diana Rodríguez Sayas, se los voy a escribir acá, porque ahí van a tener que buscar mi nombre. Esa encuesta es la que ya les mandaron, lo encontraron, lo buscaron y lo encontraron. Sí, ¿verdad que está yes. ahí? Yes, I know it's there. So, así, ¿pueden escribir solo uno o escriben los dos apellidos? Así. So, ellos van a saber que soy yo, creo que soy la única Diana Rodríguez ahí. Entonces, ponen Diana Rodríguez Ayas o Diana Sayas o Diana Rodríguez, doesn't matter, they know it's me. So, escriben ese nombre y me evalúan a mí. Ahora, la encuesta que viene, ahí no tienen que evaluarme nada a mí, sino que van a evaluar como general el curso, la academia y todo, pues en un contexto que Insafor puede entender cómo usted está con este cómo está con el programa. No sé si alguien ya, realiza, ya ha hecho estas encuestas en módulos anteriores, porque ya ha estado con... ¿No? ¿Nadie? ¿Nobody? Ok, eso va a ser primera vez para todos y espero que podamos hacerla aquí en la clase juntos. Please. Ok, that was out of the topic, but I had to tell you because that was the meeting we had, we had today. Ok. So, let's go with the class we have for today. Actually, guys, it's... I don't know, it's... We are almost finishing the, the, the course. It's almost over. I, I don't know about you, but for me, it has gone really fast. Like, I, I didn't feel the time. Did you feel the, the month that we have been here? That four no. weeks. We have been here Very four fast. weeks. Yeah, it's fast. So it's like, I don't know. It's, it's pretty fast. And I hope that you have all the, 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 the documents in order so we can start weekly okay so that's something that we need to start because sometimes with, when students take like a long time to send the documents and human resources because i know tienen que enviar unos documentos de human resources and all that so then it takes a lot of a lot of time to start the new module y ahí se nos olvida everything we have learned okay so it's very important that you have everything in order okay but now Uh, do you have any questions about anything that I have just said? No, it's so clear. Okay. Root, tengo dos roots. Así que se me sale de uno porque si no los minutos salen raros. Okay. No, ya me salí del otro. ¿Sí? Sí. Pero aquí me parece así, como que se tomó una foto. ¿A ustedes no les aparece, guys? Yeah, she's there. She's yeah. there. A ver, cuando me conecté, me salí. I don't know. Se bugueó. Like, like, como dicen los jóvenes que hoy en día. <laughs> Se bugueó esta cosa. I don't know. Something happened. Something happened, you guys. Okay. So let's start. We're going with the video conferencia 16. 16, you guys. They are 20 and 16. So uh, it's crazy. We're about to finish this. I don't know. It happened so fast. Okay. So, yeah. Sorry, I have a question with the task, the 15 task in the Task one. number 15. Task number 15, yeah. In the second one, I don't know, but I think that the, the answer is right. But uh, the question is, were you in a school yesterday? And I... Uh, respond, uh, yes, we were. Ok, let me check. Um, Brenda, todavía no han solucionado, ¿verdad? Lo de las... Or did they do it already? No. No, entonces pues ya tengo que chequear eso de nuevo. Voy a volver a mandarlo. Y me dice task 15. So there's a yeah. problem in the number. Two. Two. Okay, were you in school yesterday? So what would be the answer? I respond, yes, we were. Mm, I understand the mistake. So it's singular. It's not about a plural one, it's singular. So it will be? 
Remember that you can be singular and plural. Yeah. So, were you in school yesterday? Yes. Porque le están preguntando a usted. Usted contesta, yes. Yo sí estaba en la escuela. Yes, I was. Yes, I was. Inténtelo así. Me deja saber si le funciona, please. Yes. Did it work? Yeah? Yes. Okay, yes. excellent. Thank you, thank, thank you. you. Very good. Thank okay. You. You're welcome. Okay, so let's go here. Uh, can you read the topic, please, Floridalma? <clears throat> How to use simple past? Yes, no questions. Thank you very much. Now, can you help me with the date? Brenda. Okay, um, Wednesday, June 2nd, 2021. Excellent, thank you very much. Okay, so we're gonna use the simple past. Remember, the simple past is super easy to use. We only need the subject, the verb in the past, and the complement. So as you know, we have, for the past, we have regulars and irregular verbs, right? You know that already. The regular verbs are those verbs that when we make the past, we add ed at the end of the word, and the irregulars are those verbs that change all the structure, okay? We know that already. So we're gonna be looking just at some questions that we can make with the simple past. But today, because I know that you have, well, let me ask you this. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> Ana, esto estuvo súper gracioso, Ana Beatriz. Yo de la nada estoy viendo todas sus cámaras y de la nada vi que Ana estaba como, tengo preguntas, como que me estaba levantando las manos, pero son esa, esa imagen que tiene atrás de usted y se ve, yo sentí como que me estaba diciendo, teacher, I have a question, right? <laughs> But I like, worry, it, I like it, Bien didáctica usted. Ok, okay. So, <laughs> so, guys, um, I know, well, I'm, I have to ask you, Have you liked the activity of the tongue twisters or not? Yes. Yeah. Yes. yes. Yes, I liked it. Do you I think like do you think it's improving your pronunciation? Yes, yes. a lot of yes, helping you like. Okay. So now I have a new one. So the last one was how much wood would a witch chuck if a witch of chuck wood? But today I have a new one. But but in this case, I don't know this tongue twister. Okay, so this is gonna be my first time learning the tongue twister with you. So <laughs> it's we're gonna be learning together, okay? Because the, the only three tongue twisters that I know, and as far as I have gotten with my students, lo, lo lejos que he llegado con mis estudiantes es how much wood. Pero con ustedes ya pasamos eso. So good job. You have made me take a new challenge, and this is the new tongue twister we're gonna be learning. Okay, let me share the screen with you. So this is the one, this is, it's it's a little bit difficult. I, I promise you that I don't know it for sure. I know the pronunciation of the words, but I don't know how to say the tongue twister like all together. So we're gonna be learning together. <clears throat> the tongue twister is called, she sells seashells. So just look at that. She sells sea shells. She sells seashells. So ahí hay un tongue twister. She sells seashells. Yeah, it's, it's hard for me because I don't know it. So I'm going to read it slow and then we can practice, okay? She sells seashells by the seashore. The seashells she sells are seashells, I'm sure. So If she sells seashells by the seashore, then I'm sure she sells seashells. Ah, you see, it's my first time. Then I'm sure. <laughs> Hasta me estoy mordiendo. Uh, okay. Then I'm sure she sells seashore shells. Seashore, seashore shells. So you see, it's difficult for me too. Okay, let's do it. It's a challenge. She sells seashells by the seashore. The seashells she sells are seashells, I'm sure. So if she sells seashells by the seashore, then I'm sure she sells seashore shells. Ah, al final, it's like hard for me. Seashore shells. 
seashore shells. Yeah, that's good. Okay, let's practice again. This is, okay. <laughs> she sells seashells by the seashore. The seashells she sells are seashells, I'm sure. So if she sells seashells by the seashore, then I'm sure she sells seashore shells. Ese es el difficult para mí. Porque como que cambia la estructura. Siempre va diciendo sea, sell seashells. Pero aquí dice sell seashore shells. Oh, oh. Shell, no, me equivoqué. Sell seashore shells. <laughs> uh, do you think it's difficult or is it easy for you? No, no it's difficult. <laughs> it's difficult. It's, it's difficult. difficult. Very difficult. <laughs> In my case, también estoy entrenando también estos músculos porque, miren, acá... Me duele esto acá cuando lo estoy diciendo. This hurts. Like, como que me estoy, uh, like, I don't know. Like, como que estoy presionando esta parte acá. I don't know. I'm training. It's like when we're going to the gym. Okay, let's go. One more time. She sells seashells. Okay. She sells seashells by the seashore. The seashells she sells are seashells, I'm sure. So, if she sells seashells by the seashore, then I'm sure she sells sea Shore shells, seashore yeah. shells. I like that part is difficult for me. Then, then, uh, then I'm sure she sells seashore shells. Ahí está muy bien. Okay. Le voy a decir qué significa por si tienen dudas. Estos son seashells. Miren, estos seashells. Okay. So ella vende, este, pues, ¿cómo llamamos a esto? Conchas. Conchas de mar. Conchas. Pero literalmente Ostras. dice eso. Ostras. So ella vende mostras o conchas de mar a la orilla del mar las ostras, digamos las ostras las ostras que ella vende son ostras <ríe> estoy seguro entonces si ella vende ostras a la orilla del mar entonces estoy seguro que ella vende ostras de la orilla del mar Eso dice. Entonces estoy seguro que ella vende ostras de la orilla del mar. Okay, that's what it says. Just if you were wondering. It doesn't make sense, but yeah. So let's go one, 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 one more time. Ya está, se me está olvidando how to speak English. Oh my God. So she sells seashells by the seashore. The seashells she sells are seashells, I'm sure. So if she sells seashells by the seashore, then I'm sure she sells seashells. Ugh! Ah, the last part is difficult for me. Do you see? It's okay if it is difficult for you. Okay, let's go back one again. She sells seashells by the seashore. The seashells she sells are seashells, I'm sure. So if she sells seashells by the seashore, then I'm sure she sells seashore shells. Ah, that's better. That's better. That's better. That's better. The, the ending is so difficult for me. One more time. She sells seashells by the seashore. The seashells she sells are seashells, I'm sure. So if she sells seashells by the seashore, then I'm sure she sells seashore shells. Seashore shells, seashore shells. Yeah, seashore shells, okay? So I'm gonna give you some minutes to practice. I know it's difficult. This one is more difficult than the other ones. Uh, well, I think because it's difficult for me. So just take a screenshot and we're gonna practice like five minutes and then we're gonna come back, okay? Tell me when you're ready. And if you need me to repeat a pronunciation of a word, you can tell me and I can do it. Nope. Shells, teacher, the last word. Shells? Shells. Shells. Do you remember, you guys? There was a gas station called La yeah. Chelle. Yeah, Chelle. La Chelle. Pero decíamos Chelle, literalmente. Chelle. Like, no, Shell. Es mm -hmm. la diferencia entre CH y SH, ¿verdad? Pero Shell. Puma. Shell. Yes. Yeah, I believe it. It's, is it Puma? Oh, I didn't know that. Well, well. Okay, but, so, but Shell, ¿se acuerdan que tenía un... ¿Qué tenía de logo? Una ostra amarilla. Exactly. So you see, there, there, it makes sense now, right? Okay, so I'm going to send you to practice real quick. I know it's difficult and it's not impossible. So let's go. Just let me see if... So, um, Harbin, are you home? Anna, Harbin, Jennifer, are you still working? And Katia. 
So guys, are you available or are you doing something? Yes, I am available. Okay. Yes, Anna Elizabeth, I believe is working, right? Jennifer, are you still working? <clears throat> oh my God, what did I do? Okay, let's do this. And Katia, I think Katia is working. So this group is okay. This group, okay, okay, let's go. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Okay, I'm gonna tell okay. you. Seashell, seashell by the seashore. The seashell, seashell are the seashell I'm sure. So if the seashell, seashell by the seashore, then I sure seashell, seashore sell. Okay. She sells seashells by the seashore. The seashells she sells are seashells, I'm sure. So if she sells seashells by the seashore, then I'm sure she sells seashore shells. Seashore shells. Seashore shells. Excellent. Seashore good. Shells. Well, but but good. <laughs> really good, Flor. Okay. Thank you. <laughs> well, okay, thank Flor you. is very easy. <laughs> no. <laughs> Maybe because I speak with the S in Spanish too. <laughs> you use a lot of the S. Yes. Yes. I know that. So maybe for that. Maybe, yeah. Like how do people like that are called la chapetones, right? That's that what they call it. I, I think. Have you ever heard that word? Nunca no. esa no, never no. in your life. So okay. algo de Yo creo que sí. I think so. So chapetones aquí en Oriente son las personas que utilizan mucho la S cuando ellos están hablando y hablan como así. You see? Have you ever seen that people? ¿Han visto esa gente que se habla como que a lot with the S? No, I am a chapetona. <laughs> now you know a new word, Flor. <laughs> in, in, my, in my case, I, I only hear uh, people that are speaking with the R. A strong R? Fuerte con la R? Yes, yes. The like R. they were from Russia. For, for example, Rosa, Raton, for example. Oh, and um, but like yes. what in the Spanish, like Rosa, Raton, Rosa, Ro, I think Ro, as a Ro is Ro, but uh -huh. I think they are ticos, yes. yeah, like ticos, ticos, ticos speak like that, yes, uh -huh. that's true. 
They can say R, like us. Mm -hmm. They say R Rosa, R Rosa, Rosa. Oh, yeah, yeah, that's true, that's true. I have heard that, I have heard that, that is true. Yeah. <laughs> okay, yeah, yeah. let's continue practicing. Thank you, okay. thank you. Okay. Do it, uh, Jessica. Wow, okay. Sí. Ah. Okay. Okay. <laughs> do it, do it. Okay. Okay, I'm going to try again. Okay, Juan, do it. Okay. She sells seashells by the seashore. The seashell, the seashell, seashell are seashell, I'm sure. So if the seashell seashell by the seashore, then I am sure she sells seashore sells. <laughs> okay. So, so. <laughs> oh, look. You are so good for that. Okay. For Don Twister, you are so good. Always you can say it. <laughs> I'm coming. I will again. She sells, she sells, no, she sells seashells by the seashore. The, she, the seashells she sells are seashells, I'm sure. So if she sells seashells by the seashore, then I'm sure she sells seashore sell, shells. I know. T-shirt, seashore. 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 By the seashore. Exactly. Seashore. Okay. Seashore. Se and se shells. Seashore. Se Is. She sells seashells by the seashore. The seashells she sells are seashells, I'm sure. So if she sells seashells by the seashore, then I'm sure she sells seashore shells. Good, good job, good job. <laughs> she sells seashells by the seashore, then seashells she sells are seashells, I'm sure. So if she sells seashells, by the seashore, then I'm sure she sells seashore shells. She sells seashells by the seashore. The seashells, she, seashells are seashells, I'm sure. So if she sells seashells by the seashore, then I'm sure she So, how is it? Is it difficult? A lot of S. It's a lot of S, yes. I know, the, I know there is like a lot of S. But also, there are a lot of sh. There is like the S sound and the sh sound. And it got, it, it, it is confusing, right? The S, I work with, when to use the S, when to use the sh, 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 sh. Because I went to the breakout rooms and I hear a lot of people saying, she shells, she shells when it's she sells and you were confusing the sh and the s sound like sh 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 sh
So it's like she sells seashells, seashells by the sea shore, seashore, no seashore, because you were saying seashore too also. <laughs> so she sells seashells by the seashore. And that's confusing. Y algunos de ustedes se emocionaban y lo decían y después se quedaban como, hey, sí, lo dije, right? Like, and, and, yo no quería romperles el corazón y decirle, mire, dijo she shells, right? Like she shells instead of she sells. So yeah, it's, it's, I know it's complicated. So I'm just going to read word by word and then we're going to continue. You have some days to practice. She, 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 she sells. In this case, sells. See, see, shells. She sells seashells by the sea shore. Seashore. The sea shells. She sells. She sells. No, she shells. <laughs> she sells are seashells. Seashells. I'm sure. Sure. So, if she sells seashells, shells by the seashore, then I'm sure, I'm sure, she sells seashore shells. Okay? Just to make sure in those things, because I know it can be difficult, but we, we have to practice. And as you know, practice makes perfect okay so we have been talking about for example the how much would would a woodchuck chuck if a woodchuck would chuck would in that case we use the ch zone but in this case we're using the sh zone which is different right chuck is different than shells sh and the cha sh cha it's like yo diría que el ch es como más seco cha right chuck and the SH is like shh, shh, like you're saying shh, shells, shells, okay, like that. Okay, that's okay. So we're gonna continue and this is the question we have for today, two questions. So the first question, can you help me read the first question, Jessica? Question, you see, I'm now I feel like I'm speaking like shh, 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 question. <laughs> okay, how often do you attend trainings? Thank you very much, Jessica. How often do you attend trainings? Guys, when you pronounce this word, the T is not like really strong. It's just like, how often, often. If you can say often, and some people even say how often, often, and they don't even say the T. Um, Miguel, second question. Okay, uh, what other events do take place at your workplace? Events. Events. Okay, talking about the stress, you guys, because um, like he says at the beginning, events, es una pronunciación correcta, pero el estrés no va en la sílaba correcta. Events, no, events. Okay, what other events? Events, events. Okay, can you repeat that? Events. Okay. Events. Events. What other events do take plates at your work, please. So we're gonna discuss this question. The first one is if you attend trainings and how often, for example, um, every two weeks, every month, every year or never. And what other kinds of events can be any other kind of events take place at your workplace, okay? I know, for example, you can talk about any, any, any other events that, that happen in your work. I remember my dad used to work at Coca-Cola. So, but that's not Coca-Cola, that's La Constancia, right? So he used to work at La Constancia. And when I was little, they had different events where they can have the family go to La Constancia and they will do like matches, like soccer matches, and they will have a gift for the kids and se acuerdan de esas cosas que se ponían en los nacimientos en navidad que eran como tenían como toboganes y ositos y todas esas cosas no, you don't remember no 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 fue parte i think it was really strong for my my childhood que habían unas 
toboganes y habían ositos y estaba Santa Claus y hasta tenían una pantalla así enorme, like, I don't know what it was. But in those events, they will give that away, like, to the kids. They were like toys for the kids. So, um, for example, that, that can happen in your company. I don't know what kind of, of social events you have in your companies. If you can take your kids to work or if you have activities to have fun or I don't know, something that you have that is special in your workplace. You can talk about that. Baby showers. Baby showers. Now the other one that is super cool. Happy birthday. Yeah, like the birthdays, right? Like, but events that can be like unique to the company, okay? Like, but yeah, mm. but baby showers, yes, they happen a lot. And now it's so popular to do the gender reveal. Have you seen those parties? Like the gender reveal? Do you know what it is? No. Ruth is like, yes. So Ruth, what is a gender reveal? Uh... <laughs> Is, uh, for example, uh, if in a balloon, mm -hmm. I don't know if, if the baby is if a, is a, a girl, I don't know, the, uh, the balloon uh, inside maybe color pink. have a, blue. a color ah, of blue. blue or blue. pink or I, I don't know. Yeah, 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 yeah. I yeah. know. I exactly. Know. That is the end of the reveal. Personal opinion, I don't like those things. I prefer baby showers. I don't like the gender reveal. Not at all, because I don't think a color is related to a gender. Not at all. I don't like pink. It's like this is orange, I think. I hate pink. My favorite color, white. So no, pink that. So yeah, whatever. But those events you can mention or just mention special events that you have in your companies. For example, getaways. You know what is a getaway? No. When you go together as a company to a different place. So for example, you get together and you go to La Pampa del Volcán. I don't know, something like that, you know? Like que se van juntos y van como todos en compañía, en un microbús y hasta que nos vamos con Don Pedro, usted vaya a ser con no sé quién, yo voy con no sé cuánto, and they go together to a place, okay? So I know those, sé que hay compañías que hacen esto. For example, Telus, you know what is Telus, right? The call center. So Telus, they go and they have a giving back date, un día donde entregan de nuevo y hacen como siembran plantas, van a lugares a jugar con niños y entregan a las comunidades. So, es, eventos especiales que hagan en sus compañías, ¿me entienden? Yes. I don't know, if, if you have those, if you don't have those, just, I don't know, talk about a company where, where they do it. Okay, so first question, if you go to trainings and special events that can happen in your workplace, any kind of special events, okay? So let me just create again the breakout rooms. Uh, Ana Elizabeth is working, right? So this is good. And Kat is working. And Jennifer. Okay, let's go.
better now. Training. Mm -hmm. And in another occasion, uh, are uh, for another another companies, yeah, to 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 impart this kind of of training. Mm -hmm. uh, normally, is for uh, how to 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 talk with the with the coworker. Uh, for example, a feedback, coding, a, 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 this kind of, of training. Yeah, because I because I am supervisor and I have to mm -hmm. to have these skills. You have to know. Yeah, for for a, make well my job. Me doy entender? Yeah. Yeah. Do you understand? Okay. Yeah. Hello, Jennifer. Hello, teacher. Uh, are you use... still working? No, I I'm connecting to the computer. Oh, pero se va a desconectar del otro dispositivo. Yeah. Okay, la voy I a mandar use... al grupo. Yo está en el grupo. En el grupo está en el uno. Okay. Okay. Ahí estaba con Rolando, Brenda y Jessica, ¿verdad? Sí. Ok. Thanks, teacher. Ok. Okay. Uh, for for that say Miguel Angel, um, I don't like draw. I don't like, but use every day AutoCAD. But yes. I don't. I don't like. I don't like draw. But I have to use yes. the program. Yes, this is a training. It was uh, difficult for me, but the AutoCAD is new. It's new for me. Oh, okay, but it's new. Yes, I, I, I never, I, I have never uh, worked with this program. But is it? I, I don't is know. Yes, it's, it's uh, very interesting, very interesting. Yes. AutoCAD have more than 80,000 commands. Yes, yes. More, it more. It's expensive. Many. Yes, yes. Expensive. So, many and Revit do you know Revit mm, no it's another software yeah. it's another it's another software similar to AutoCAD but okay. it is better more better anything about the the vacuum tomorrow okay. he, he is going to vaccine to get um, a, another vaccine Yes. Second one. The second one, yes. Okay. It's good, it's good. And you, Harvey? I don't know. I, I never think about it. <laughs> but I, 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 I say yes. If I have the opportunity, I take it. Me too. And you, teacher? Yes. <laughs> <laughs> me what? Me what? If you have the opportunity to to take the vaccine 
actually, COVID. actually, yo ya debería tener esa vacuna. Yeah, you're a, I'm a teacher. Yeah. yeah. So, so, but I'm waiting, happened? I'm still waiting. Yo estoy en la nómina, a la mayoría de mis compañeros ya lo vacunaron. They got vaccinated like a month ago and they had the second doses and I haven't. So I don't know, I'm still waiting. And yes, I will take it. I will take it for sure. I'm okay. not going to risk it. <laughs> like many people are saying, no van a poner un chip. And I'm like, look, guys, this is the chip that you have. Aquí no están controlados. Like, yeah. uno dice, ay, quisiera comprar una cama doble. Me van a aparecer anuncios de una cama doble. Yes, it's true. Up. Yeah. Chip de que, no, 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 that's not true. Lo que sí hay que fijarse, you guys, es que sí, le pongan y le pongan el líquido. So yo voy a estar así. Because yeah. I, I have seen yes. videos where they just put it and take it out. Like, what? Yes. That's yes. That. So yo tengo miedo, pero eso sí lo voy a ver porque tengo más miedo que me mientan y yo ande como, ay, ya estoy vacunada. And like nothing, right? <laughs> <laughs> no, so like, yeah, vacunada y aquí el COVID. No, una gripe de ser. Y like 15 días después, no, no, no. I'm not going to risk it. So, and, and you, any of you have gotten vaccinated? No. no. Not yet. No, not yet. Okay. no, not yet. My husband tomorrow is going to, to get the vaccine. I think, vaccine. I think now the 40 to 50 can get vaccinated, right? Yes. 40 to 50, I believe. 40 to 50 years old, yeah. Yes. 40. La otra población de riesgo. Yes. <laughs> okay, okay. Did you finish the activity? Yes. Uh, we, we are talking okay. about that. We, okay. we are not finished, Harvey. Yes. Only had been finished. Oh, yes, only we are not. Interesting. Hasta que lo sacó el, 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 el Zoom, you come back to the class. But if it was 10 p.m., I wonder. It's night. Only if it was 10 p.m., it'll be like. Very exciting. Yeah, I know. So you were practicing. And I know it's interesting because when I went to some breakout rooms and I asked, Did you finish? Some of my students said, Yes, teacher, we finished. 
and that is not correct to say, right? But when I called you to come back to the main class, to the main, main session, you were like, not coming. So I'm like, didn't they finish? Hmm, it's good. The gossiping is good, right? I know, it's good. Okay, uh, because yo fue a break room, si me sacaron plática, so yeah, it's, it's, it's okay. <laughs> Let's go with the second attendance, okay? Ana Beatriz Valencia Ruiz. I'm here. Ana Elizabeth Berrios de Sandoval. I'm here. Brenda Arlinda Sanz Villatoro. I'm here. Claudia Lorena Carca Morgueta. Diana Yesenia Reyes Alas. Qué raro que no esté Diana. Estefanía Alexandra Aguilar Céspedes. Florida Alma Ramírez Calderón. I'm here. Harvin Isaac Guevara Miranda. I am here. Did you finish, Harvin? No. Ah, okay, okay. <laughs> Jennifer Gisela López Sánchez. I'm here, teacher. Okay. Um, Juan José Avalos Campos. I'm here. Katia Margarita Herrero Pérez. Kerry Tiffany Rosales Figueroa. Merlin Lisbeth Ventura Cruz. Miguel Ángel Centeno González. Rolando Antonio Quintanilla, Ciudad Real. I'm here. Ruth Saraí Medrano Aguilar. I'm here. Ruth Noemí Sánchez Pérez. Zuleima Lisset Méndez Romero. No. William Antonio Morales Mancía. Jessica Yanari Cortés Díaz. I'm here. Josué Efraín Cáceres Escalón. Y Silvia María Rivera Rivas. Ok. Ok, you guys. Um, now let's go with the conversation that we have for today. Ok, I'm just going to... Escucho ruidos, but I don't know where is the audio. Ok, let's go. I'm going to share my screen. Me pasó, es que mi pronunciation is very important. With another group, it happened to me that when they were saying the ice cream, you scream, we'll scream for ice cream, they were saying ice cream, you scream. And you know what is screen? What is screen? Screen? Screen uh, is a... Um... Pantalla. Exactly. Yeah. That screen. Entonces ya estaban diciendo yo pantalla, tu pantalla, todos pantalla. And it's ice cream, right? Ice cream. <laughs> Esa letrita al final que era fuera de N a M hace una gran diferencia. So yeah, we have to pay attention to the pronunciation. Okay. So now let's go with the conversation we have here. And this is the conversation. Remember, I'm going to read it twice. The first time is for pronunciation and the second time is for intonation. Let's go. Hey, Lorna, how are, are, remember, are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lana, yes, I did. The training, training, training was awesome, awesome. It was at the new hotel, hotel. Sounds great. Tell me everything, everything about it. Was it difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very, very challenging, challenging. Many international speakers, speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speakers? Uh, let's see, Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. I love Miss Sanini. 
she was the first, first international CEO, CEO to visit, v, v, visit or our company two years ago. You are right. Do you need me to repeat an, a word? Yes, teacher. Awesome. 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 Just okay. maybe just wait a minute. I'm going to look for it because I know it's awesome, but it can be different. Awesome. 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 Yes. Awesome. 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 Yeah, you see. So let me. Awesome. Awesome. You see? Awesome. 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 Okay. Awesome. Another word? Nope. Okay. Let's go with intonation now. Okay. Hey, Lorna. How are you? Remember, intonation. Hey, Lorna. How are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lana, yes, I did. The training was awesome. It was at the new hotel. Sounds great. Tell me everything about it. Was it difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speakers? Uh, let's see, Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Zinini from Brazil. Oh, I love Miss, no dice oh ahí, pero yo le puse el oh para Mike. I love Miss Zanini. She was the first interna international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You're right. Okay, is it clear or do you want me to repeat it once again? Clear? Once again, teacher, please. Okay. okay. Hey, Lorna, how are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lana, yes, I did. The training was awesome. And it was, I mean, it was the new hotel. Sounds great. Tell me everything about it. <clears throat> was it difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speakers? Uh, let's see. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Zanini from Brazil. Oh, I love Miss Zanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You're right. You are right. Okay. So time to practice that conversation. Just, I know some students, Katia, are you home already? Or still working? I guess Katia is still working. And who else is working? Working, working. Anna Elizabeth, are you home already? You're home, no, 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 no. Anna Elizabeth, you're still working? Yes, I'm still working, teacher. Okay, um, Jennifer, you are ready, right? You were participating in the yes. last episode. Okay, uh, and just that. So just let me change here. Mm -hmm. This is good, 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 and good. Let's go.
Sounds great. Tell me everything about it. Was it difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who are the speakers? Uh, let's see. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. I love Miss Sanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You are right. Okay. Okay. I start, okay. right? Okay. Hey, tell me everything about it. Was it difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speakers? Uh, let's see. Andrew jo Johnson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. I love Miss Sanini. She was the first international CEO to visit our company two years ago. You are right. You are okay. right. Now. So I start. Okay. I'm going, sir. Okay. Hey, uh, hey, Lorna, how are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lana, yes, I did. The training was awesome. It was at the new hotel. Sounds great. Tell me everything about it. Was it difficult? Well, it wasn't that difficult, but it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speakers? Oh, let's see. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Sinini from Brazil. I love Miss Sinini. She was the first international CEO to visit our World. Okay. Okay. Again. You are, you are la Yes. Hey, Lorna. How are you? Did you attend the training last week? Lana, yes. I did the training. It was awesome. It was at the new hotel. Sound great. Tell me everything about it. Was it difficult? Well, it wasn't the diffi that difficult. But it was very challenging. Many international speakers came. No kidding. Who were the speakers? Mm, let's see. Andrew Johnson from England and Magali Sanini from Brazil. I love Miss Sanini. She was the first international CEO, CEO to visit our company to
Hi. It's raining, uh, teacher. Is it raining? Listen. Hmm? It's raining where you live, guys? Can you listen? No, I don't hear it. I don't hear. Maybe your headset is as good as mine. That we can hear the gecko, but we cannot hear the rain. <laughs> <laughs> right. So, well, guys, um, now we're going to go with the next activity that is answering questions about the conversation. Then we have another activity that is in the manual. And then we have another activity that I know you're going to love. It's going to be interesting for you. I know it's going to be interesting because it's about the past but we're gonna make questions, questions to have conversations about our past, the real past, okay? So it's gonna be interesting. And then we have Rolando's video, right? About how to make a newspaper, yeah. Okay, let's go here. Can you read the first question, um, Ana Beatriz? How does Lorna describe the training? Okay. Uh, do you want to answer anyone? Anyone who wants to answer? How does Lorna? It was awesome. It was awesome. Excellent. Awesome, but? It was challenging. Excellent. There was many international speakers. Excellent. Thank you very much, Jennifer. So it was awesome, but challenging. Excellent. Um, Juan Jose, can you read the second question? Uh, you're excuse muted. Me, excuse me, excuse okay. me, excuse me. Oh, but I, the second, I can see. I don't know why not see it. You don't see my screen? No, 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 no. In this moment, no, I don't know why. Tal vez se ha salido, se ha puesto en los videos. Tiene que entrar de nuevo donde está el compartir. Okay, 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 okay. okay. Uh, but I can see the... You, you, uh, uh, sure, screen. I don't, oh, uh, yes. You I don't see to, my screen? No, 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 no. I'm going to. Okay, let me just it, do it again. It. Okay, okay. Now? Okay, oh, yeah, yes. Uh, number two, when was the first time Mrs. Anini came to the ladies' company? Okay, so when was the first time, you guys, can you tell me? Excellent, good job. Um, Harbin, can you read the third question? Where did the training take place? Where did the training take place? Okay, where, guys? New At hotel. the new hotel. hotel. At the new hotel. Do you know what I like the most about trainings? The That's food. very beautiful place. The food. It's the food. food. Yes, that's what They're I love cool. about trainings. Oh my God, you guys, I'm in love with the food. I'm uh, like, I have a serious problem with the food. Like you see me, I don't know if you cannot see it, but I'm not thin, no soy delgada, like not at all. Y si me preguntan por qué, yo sí, like, no la gente que dice, no, es que yo respiro y me engordo. No, no, you, I eat. Oh. Y esto es caro, guys. This is expensive. This is not yeah. like, a, no. Tortilla con frijol, yeah, me gusta, pero me hacen daño los frijoles. So no, no, it's expensive. So yes, I accept it. Okay, <laughs> let's go here, guys. How to use the verb be in the past. I know you know this already, but you, we're just going to make like a review here, okay? So uh, can you help me read the first part here, um, 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 Miguel? Okay, use the past of B to talk about situation in the past. Okay, thank you very much, Miguel. So we're gonna use it to talk about situations in the past. And we have two forms of the past of B, was and where, okay? Was is with I, he, she, it. And where we use it with we, they, and you. Here we have affirmative statements and negative statements. The affirmative statements are really easy. You just ask was or where. So for example, what the training, 
was very helpful. The training, si ustedes quitaran the training, podríamos suplantarlo por it, ¿verdad? It was very helpful. It was very helpful. All the employees, so they, were happy to attend. The negative can be the two ways. The first form is separated, was not, and the second form is a contraction with the verb and the not. Okay, so it's instead of saying was not, you say wasn't. Instead of saying were not, you say weren't. So it was not difficult, or you can say it wasn't difficult. Is that clear? I, I think it's clear, right? You know that already. Yeah? Teacher, teacher, mm -hmm. the pronunciation was of were is, is, is not similar to were. Yeah, it's the same. It's the same. Where were you? Yeah. For example, if I said, ¿Dónde estabas? Where were you? Oh, okay. It's the same. It's the same. Let's, oh. let's, you, we can look at here. You will see. Si ¿Sí pueden ver lo que estoy escribiendo? Yeah. Yeah. You see. Where. It's the same. It's the same, but just like a or at the end. Where were? Oh, where were? Okay. Where were? Where, where. That's the same. I, I have these two, these. Now, with this, with this. Let's say that the where as the past of P is more like were. And the other one is where. Where were? Where were? Where were? Similar. Similar. Okay. So. Uh, 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 Let me, <clears throat> okay, here. <clears throat> Read the paragraph below and answer the question. Mary went to a training in Guatemala last Tuesday. The training was interesting, interesting, no interesting, no. Interesting because she learned how to fix the equipment she uses and how to prevent damages on it. The presenter was really helpful and he clarified all doubts Mary had. He used a computer to present examples during the speech. Do you have questions with pronunciation? Yes. Mm -hmm. Would you mind repeating damages? Damages. Damages. Yes. Thank you. Prevent damages. Okay. Another one. Equipment or equipment. 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 Okay. Equipment. Equipment. Yeah, if you don't like, I know it's a difficult word, so just let's do it here. Equipment. You see, equipment. Equipment. It says like equipment. It's okay. Oh. No se escucha, verdad? No. Oh. <laughs> you no, know, I was no. like, and I'm sharing the screen. Yeah. Equipment. It's like E at the beginning. Equipment, but slow. Equipment. 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 Okay. okay. Equipment. <clears throat> no, this is not. This is it. Okay. Another one. Equipment. Equipment. Helpful. And he clarified, clarified all doubts Mary had. He used a computer to present example during the speech. Do you want me to repeat all that, Rolando? Yes. Okay. The presenter was really helpful. And he clarified, clarified all doubts, doubts Mary had. He used a computer to present examples during the speech. Thank you. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys. So now we're going to go to the break room rooms and you are going to pronounce these. Read it with your classmates. Help your classmates with pronunciation. And then you have to answer these questions, okay? Take a screenshot if you might.
Ready? Yes. Just let me see. <laughs> Katy, are you home already? Yes, teacher. Excellent. Good job. So just Anna is working, right? It's just Anna, 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 Anna. This is good. This is good. Okay, let's go. Let's go.
did you like did you like it yes i I like, I did. Yes. Yes. I like yes, it. I, yes. Yes, I did. Oh, I like. Yes, yes I, I like. I, yes. Uh, if it is a did question, is yes, I did or no, I didn't. Oh, okay. Yes, I did. Uh, okay. Yes, I did. The next one is, uh, what did you learn? She learns how to fix the equipment. Yes. Or she learned how to fix the equipment. Uh, she learns. Yeah. Okay. She learned learned in the past. Learn how it, yeah. Is the final finish with and is working. Ah, okay. okay. Yeah. Uh, it's your tour, Jessica, to meet the box. Wow, it's raining cats and dogs. Jessica. Shakui. <laughs> <laughs> I'm writing. I'm writing the answer. Uh, okay. <laughs> Why the uh, just just Jessica just Jessica just Jessica no? <laughs> you learn oh, ha, ha. you learn the answer is oh, ha, ha. she use no 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 she learn how to fix she learn. Learn, learn how to fix the equipment. To fix the equipment. To fix the equipment. And equipment. And prevent what damages. damages. What happened? Damages. Ten cuidado. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? Where did, are we? Did you did you watch Gracias yes, a él somos okay. un ejemplo mundial? <laughs> How to use <laughs> PS3 i camera? Oh, I'm sharing that. Oh, can you see this? Oh. <laughs> <laughs> To do. <laughs> Thanks. That's finally uh, uh, that I'm that I'm How do you feel? Yeah. <laughs> I died. It was better that it was not something else. Um, yeah, I know. <laughs> Point. Training in Guatemala last Tuesday. The training was interesting because she learned how to fix the equipment she used and how to prevent damages on it. The presenter was really helpful and he clarified all doubts Mari had. He used a computer to present examples during the speech. Katia? Mary went to training in Guatemala last Thursday. The training was interesting because she learned how to fix the equipment she used and how to prevent damages on it. The present was really helpful and he qualified Terrific old dudes. Mary had. He used a computer. He used a computer to present example during the speech. Okay. Clarify. Clarified. He clarified. Okay, Katia. How was the training? Was interesting. Juan Jose, when was the training? I knew Juan. Excuse me. Flor, do you like it? <laughs> yes, I like it. <laughs> and what did you learn, Flor? <laughs> A lot of I, I learned how to prevent damage. Um, okay. yes. Katia, what was and the how to, uh, Wait, wait, wait. And how oh, to sorry. use the equipment. Yes. Okay. okay. Nice. Like, give me an answer quickly, please. Quickly. It's not time. <laughs> 
quickly the teacher no pressure is... teacher no pressure <laughs> yeah, yeah yeah i can see that no pressure yeah <laughs> okay and katya Teacher. Teacher. Oh my God. He's grown? Yes. It's the Today same they, it's the same dog? Yes, they are one month. They oh. are now. They look so big. Oh my God. And they were so tiny the first time, right? Yes. They were so tiny. And now they are big. Oh, <laughs> he's so cute. Is a he or a she? It's he. Is a he. What, do you have a name for it, him? Yes, Max. Max. Hey, Max. Look at Max. He's so beautiful. <laughs> he's going to be the star student. <laughs> yes. Aww. He can bark in English. <laughs> yes. <laughs> <laughs> it will be like wow, yes, no wow, wow. <laughs> no <laughs> and he, he says goof goof no wow wow and this <gasps> is a boo look at the look at the it's it's <laughs> and he's biting the 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 paw is a, is a he? he he it's a boo like the mon the monkey the Al aladdin's monkey boo Abu, 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 Abu. Oh, oh no, oh. This, this, this is Abu. The oh. other was uh, Maya. It's, Maya. It's a girl. Yes. Maya. And and this, this is Abu. Yes, this You're is Abu. You're confusing them. Oh my God. Look at Abu. And the last, the last, I promise, is the last. Okay, okay. Oh. Oh, look this, at that. This is Otis. It's a girl. 
Oh, this is, look at is the, is the baby girl. She, she was the last one? No, but it's, it's the smallest. Yes. Oh, look at her. She's so beautiful. <laughs> <laughs> I just gonna, uh, right? <laughs> okay, sorry. We, no, we can continue, teacher. That's fine. That's <laughs> fine. You just make us happy. Look at the smiles on your classmates' faces. <laughs> they were smiling. <laughs> hey, bye. <laughs> they were so beautiful. Oh my God. I love, I love pets. I am Flor. <laughs> oh yeah. Well, well, hi, Flor. Look at Flor. Oh my God. <laughs> I am so cute. She's so cute. You guys look at Flor, right? And she's a, it's a she, right? She's a girl. <laughs> That's funny. That's funny. Okay, you guys. Well, back to the topic again. <laughs> so we had the activity and it was fun. But right now we have another activity that is super fun. It's going to get really fun. With this activity, we're going to practice the past. Vamos a practicar el pasado. But con temas de los que ustedes quieran hablar. Okay. So for example, I have a list of questions that you can make to talk about the past. So look at this list. You can make any other question. Okay. So what did you do last weekend? Easy. What did you do your last vacation? We can talk about that. Did you finish the homework on the platform maybe? That's another one. This number four, it's interesting. What is the funniest thing you remember as a child? Can you remember what was the funniest thing that happened to you when you were little? Five, look at this question. Do you remember your first crush? How was it? So, ¿se acuerdan de ese primer crush? Do you know what is the word crush? What is crush? I know you know. Amor platónico. Exactly. So who was your first crush, right? How was it? So who cooked last night's dinner for you? Or if you cooked the last night dinner, you can say, what did you do last Christmas? Okay. The last Christmas was very sad for me. What was the last present you received? You know what is a present, right? Like a gift. When did you start at your job? How was your first week like? When empezaste en tu trabajo y tu primera semana, ¿cómo fue? Right? Like nervous. You didn't know like many things. What was your first job? Your first job ever. Did you like it? Did you seriously injure a part of your body as a child? What happened? Do you have questions about this? ¿Tienen preguntas sobre alguna pregunta que no entiendan? Mm -mm. Teacher, teacher, only pronunciation and, and number two is vacation or vacation. 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 But vacation. no, no like vacation, no. No, v no. V va vacation. Vacation. Okay. okay. So okay. let's try. Now you have to just, let's see, let's see. Ruth, you can ask me a question. Um, Después yo le voy a preguntar. Ah. Uh, who cooked last night dinner for you? Uh, it was my mom. Usually I cook, but yesterday was my mom. I ate um mushroom cream. Mushroom cream. Yes, I ate a mush. I love mushroom cream. Excellent, Ruth. Um. Did you finish the homeworks on the platform? Uh, <laughs> and no, no, I. No, you haven't finished. But I, I finished the task fifteen. Oh, okay. So you're close to the end. Let's say that, yeah. right? Okay. <laughs> Excellent, Ruth. Thank you very much. Now let's talk about other one. You can ask me a question, Jessica. Do you do last Christmas? 
uh, I, sp <laughs> I spent last Christmas locked down in a room with nobody by my side because I had COVID. So I was alone for last Christmas. It was so sad. I, I actually play music on my phone and play it so loud that I couldn't hear the parties and everything. I just played the music and I went to sleep because I didn't want to cry because I was alone. So it was, it was, that was what I did. And the food, it was like eating paper. Doesn't have any, didn't have any taste because yeah, you know, COVID. Yeah, that was sad. Okay, uh, Jessica, um, what was the last present you received? Teacher, Ed, mm? can you explain me the question number 11, please? Si alguna vez te golpeó una parte de su cuerpo muy grave, ¿y qué pasó? Okay, thank you. Okay. Um, Jessica, back to you. Okay. Uh, what was the last present you received? Uh, I never received a present. <gasps> never, not even a candy or a churrito. No. Never, not your kid. No. Nunca ha llegado su niño así con una florcita y le ha dicho, mami, mira esta florcita que dice. No, no. Just, just my son is a. Yeah. Eso he cuenta. Give me, he give me. <laughs> you see, you see. Okay. Mi, mi gato yeah. me trajo un pajarito. Like. <laughs> oh, yo le, oh, oh, y yo oh, se lo quité, yo le agarré oh. de aquí y le quité el pajarito. <laughs> or a gecko or, yeah, or okay. a mouse. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. They do that. Okay, guys. Yeah. So we're gonna do this activity. Did you take a screenshot? Porque me han quedado bien poquitos. Oh my god, you guys. What el happened? Gecko sí se escucha. ¿Mm? El sí gecko se escucha. Sí se escucha. Oh my god. Sí, lo demás no, pero el gecko sí. Okay, take a screenshot. We're gonna go to the breakout rooms really quick, and we're gonna ask these questions to our classmates but you have to make them speak so maybe ask them do you remember your first crush how was it right or maybe about the injured i don't know why pero nuestras edades ya creciendo nos gusta hablar de las heridas de las enfermedades de qué medicina toma y qué será bueno para que ellos viera que a mí me ayudó esto El so, remedio. Yeah, we like to talk about that yo cuando me veo con mis amigas digo ya crecimos jóvenes because we like to talk about medicines ok so let's go
Hi, Jennifer. They live at San Pedro Perulapan. San Pedro. Oh, okay. okay. But I couldn't live with them because it's too far and is there is not a good signal for my job and I have to have at least 10 MB for my job. Oh, okay. Good. Yeah. Another question. Uh, Miguel, did Tell you me. seriously endure a part of your body as a child? And what happened? Um, I, I remember that I, I don't have injury. I don't okay. remember, but... Mm -hmm. I enjoy it. <laughs> 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 what happened I with, with your song, Brenda? <laughs> <laughs> there is a problem with my connection. <laughs> mm. <laughs> what are you talking about, guys? Brenda is choosing song depends on the on the question. She has well, a playlist. Yes. <laughs> Guys, it's funny because I just came from a breakup room where only were like well, not only boys, but only one girl and the other ones were boys and they are so just like, do you remember your first crush? Yes, let's you know, who was it? Okay, well, okay, who cooked like the dinner for you? They are like just <laughs> making the questions. And right here I can see that you're gossiping about and, the questions. And we are yeah. playing music. <laughs> mm, interesting. They get me with me. Oh, <laughs> teacher, you, you can hear Jessica. I, are you ready, Brenda? <laughs> yes? Well, go ahead. <laughs> okay, okay, let's see. Jessica, do you remember your first crush? And how was it? I never have a crush. Wait, teacher, wait, wait. You never had a crush, Jessica? No, never. Brenda! <laughs> Hi, Brenda! <laughs> well, <laughs> very good, Brenda. It's very good, Brenda. I like it. I like it. <laughs> but lo que me gustó más es que to toca la canción toda distorsionada. <laughs> like super sad. Tan triste que ni siquiera la canción original. <laughs> <laughs> no that I don't know how to say no dar el ancho. Maybe you you couldn't do that. You maybe you couldn't 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 live to the expectations. Oh I I don't cool, cool. I couldn't live to the expectations or I couldn't work to the expectations. Yes, just in, in my first first week, I, I don't know, I I was very confused. I and I thought so uh, to uh, left the work, but I I hear <laughs> okay. And what I about can't... you, Katya? When did you start I... at your job and how was
Here's your one answer, right? Me gustó, ¿verdad? I liked it, I liked it, yes. Yes, it was funny, I know. There were some break rooms, guys, when we, where we have even music in the background for the different situations about the questions. It was interesting. It was very interesting. <laughs> okay, let's go with the last attendance because it's late, it's very late. Ana Beatriz Valencia Ruiz. I'm here. Ana Elizabeth Berrios de Sandoval. I'm here. Brenda Linda Sáenz Villatoro. I'm here. Claudia Lorena Carcomorqueta, Diana Yesenia Reyes Alas, Estefanía Alexandra Aguilar Céspedes, Florida Alma Ramírez Calderón. I'm here. Harvin Isaac Guevara Miranda. I'm here. Jennifer Gisela López Sánchez. I'm here. Juan José Ábalos Campos. Katia Margarita Herrero Pérez. I'm here. Kerry Tiffany Rosales Figueroa. Merlin Lisbeth Ventura Cruz. Miguel Ángel Centeno González. Here. Rolando Antonio Quintanilla Ciudad Real. I'm here. Ruth Saraí Medrano Aguilar. I'm here. Ruth, me voy a quedar hoy con usted. Okay. Okay. Um, Suleima Lisset Méndez Romero. William Antonio Morales Mancía. Jessica Yanari Cortés Díaz. I'm here. Okay. Um, Rolando, ¿podemos poner el video mañana? Porque hoy sí ya me quedé bastante sin tiempo. No sé si podríamos ponerlo mañana. Sí, claro. ¿Estaría no bien? No problema. Sí, okay. a la hora que usted me diga. Ok, ok. So, tomorrow. Lo voy a dejar en la planificación, ok? Ok. Ok. So, have a good night. Solo me quedo con Ruth. Ok, bye. Bye, 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 bye. 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 Bye, Ruth. Bye, Jennifer. Bye, bye. Bye, bye. Bye, Brenda. <laughs> ¿Por qué te veo bebé? <laughs> Bye, bye, bye. Hello, Ruth. Hello. <laughs> How are you? Fine, so nervous. Why are you nervous? I don't know. <laughs> to stay with me? Uh, maybe. <laughs> don't be nervous, why? We can talk about many things, don't worry, it's okay. This, this time is just to talk about, for example, any questions that you have, questions about the classes, or if they are not about the topics in the classes, any questions that you have about English, anything? About, I don't know. I, for in the classes, I, I feel that all is right, it's good, but the, the problem, I don't know, it's with me, with my, I don't know, my ex experience, experience of the pronunciation, vocabulary, and the listening. So it's, it's high difficult, the listening for me. The reading is it, it's not, <laughs> but I think that uh, I need more vocabulary because when I, talk about something and it's difficult for me to say, say that I don't know. So it's difficult for you the pronunciation but also um, speaking you need more vocabulary when speaking Yes, more vocabulary and the pronunciation is not hard I don't okay. know it's like in my mind I assimilo assimilo the pronunciation. Right? Okay, okay. But it, I think that is the vocabulary and the grammar because when I I am speaking, I, in my mind, I, I think, I'm, I'm thinking, and what is the grammar to say something? So, so you're thinking, I'm guessing, in Spanish. Yes. <laughs> So that's and one problem, right? Yes, I think that that is the problem because in English is very different. So I have had many students that say, sure, but why do we do this? But in Spanish is like this, right? Yeah, so yeah. The first problem that we have is that we know Spanish and we want to compare everything to, to, to Spanish, right? 
But remember when we were little and when we were babies, no estábamos comparando, ay, ¿por qué esto se dice agua? Pero en idioma bebé se dice agua, right? Like we were not thinking about that. It was, it was your learning a first language. So it's the same with English. No se pregunte tanto por qué. It's just like that. It's just like that, okay? And do you, do you listen to music in English? No. Uh, I, when, I, when I start this, these classes online, I start to, uh, I start, start to uh, hear some, some songs, but uh, it's not uh, always. <laughs> Okay, okay. So, but what kind of music do you like, for example? It's like pop or... And usually I, I hear a more, uh, how do you say, Christian. Christian music? <laughs> like, uh, Christian, like, uh, what is the name? Uh, Hilson United. And... Uh, casting work, casting. I don't know what is. I don't remember. But, but, but do they sing uh, in English? I uh, yes. I try to learn the 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 lyric, uh, because of because of uh, if I learn and I know uh, how what uh, say the, the song and it's more easy to me learn the easier lyric and easier mm -hmm. easier to me learn the lyric and learn more vocabulary some some word mm -hmm. so do you have a spotify yes so on spotify i don't know if you have noticed that on spotify for example if you're listening to any song and you go up like this, it shows you the lyric. <laughs> At the same time you're playing the song, it will show you the lyric. So I'm gonna show you. Just put a, a new song. No lo voy a reproducir porque me dan derecho de autor. Okay, so for example, I have this girl that is going famous is Olivia Rodrigo. So look at this. So for example, I'm gonna play the song. So I play the song here and look at this. Oh. So while the music, you see, in mm -hmm. the white lines are the ones that are being synced. So this one, the, you see? Oh, you see? Great. Right? So yeah. you can have that option. I, 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 yes, I, I know uh, some uh, songs, uh, that like a uh, 20 uh, like a uh, 90s or uh, the song they yeah. <laughs> have yeah yeah and yeah that, the oldies. that is, is easier to, to the pronunciation of word so for example when i was going to the classrooms right i tried to learn lyrics or songs with my students but now online is not possible because derecho de autor copyright mm -hmm. so this one is one of the songs that I will play for my students. That one. And I love her. I love the okay. And this one, it, it's so slow, but it will help you. Um, this is another one. How deep is your love? I think it's Biggies. Let me, let me look for the... And if you have so, Netflix, no. Uh, okay, so you can watch series. I was going to say in English. Okay, and you were you were going to ask something. Uh, so, uh, also, I don't don't load don't lo load it. Okay, I you downloaded. Download an mm -hmm. uh, an app. Uh, the cake, cake, the name is cake. Cake is the name of the app. Yes, and it's for learn uh, English. And 
Uh, it, it, it have a, a right phrases, a real phrases. I, I don't know, it's like a, una escena. A movie escena. or TV show? Oh, uh, yes, uh, for uh, whatever it can be uh, a movie or a game or TV show. TV show and I think that is is good uh, and I in every day I I uh, I try in that uh, for ten or twenty minutes uh, the, uh, for practice to learn, for practice yes okay so I will say Ruth that your level your English level is all right, because you're in Principiante 6 and you're about to be intermediate. It's good because I remember when I was intermediate, I was not good at all. I was like, mm, nah. And then when I went to advanced English, I was like, I was in advanced English, but I didn't feel like I was in advanced English. I was like, no, I feel like I'm still basic or something like that. I, I don't think I can speak English. But then, in my case, it was different because I had the opportunity to go to live in the United States. So there, when I was speaking with native speakers, I noticed that my English was not bad. It was like good. The only thing that I needed was to practice a little bit more. So that's, that's the thing. I will say that you are good so far and you keep practicing, you can watch it. You keep watching movies or series, keep listening to music in English, learning lyrics, uh, learning tongue twisters, for example, that, that I know that you have been doing, right? Mm -hmm. That will help you a lot. But I will say that your English so far, I like it. It's really good. Thanks. <laughs> because you're yeah, just I, I feel, basic I feel six. like a basic, uh, I don't know. <laughs> You should see, I have had students, like the example that I told you, that I asked my students, hey, what's your name? And they say, pupusa. <laughs> so that's basic zero, okay? So you're not in basic zero right now. You're, you can understand what I'm saying, right? Yes. The only thing that is difficult is to express your ideas because you're thinking in Spanish. Yes, I, I think that is the, my, uh, my problem, the mayor problem main problem the main problem because i think in, in spanish and then i try to translate it in english trans translating in in english uh, the grammar in spanish so, so yeah that's a problem because spanish and english are very different so you will be like no but why 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 so I used to think in, in Spanish before I speak in English, but now I think in, in English. Most of, the, most of the time I speak, I think, and I speak in English, but that's because your mind gets used to it as much as you practice. The only thing that I can tell you and I, my advice will be just practice a lot, but your English is good. I like it. Okay. <laughs> okay, Ruth, any more questions? Nothing? No. Okay, no, so that will be it no. for today, and I will see you tomorrow, okay? Okay, see you. Have a good night. Good night. Bye-bye. <laughs>